Hey Alley Cats, I am back with a makeup tutorial. I'm gonna show you how I got this look with the Give It To Me Straight palette by ColourPop. I love ColourPop makeup. It is affordable, it is highly pigmented, it is just everything I need in life, and more honey, yes more, okay? More life, more everything. I also use a few other ColourPop products, and you will see in the video. Um, but I have this beautiful, glowy, Wakanda princess look. Do you love it? Do you love this necklace? You can get this necklace right now on PanzelBeauty.com, okay? That is my business, okay? And this hair is also Panzel Beauty. It is virgin hair. Y'all, I have to plug. I gotta do the plug, I'm sorry. <laughs> Shameless plug. But it's Ponzel Beauty Hair, and it's virgin, and as you can see, I bleached it. I did a little highlight. The golden look, the, the yes, the oranges, the, the golds, the, look, at the nails are orange, like, the summer glow, and I wanna show you guys how to, how to get the glow. Ponzelbeauty.com for the hair and the necklace, and then ColourPop Cosmetics, for the makeup. I had it turned backwards, my bad. So let's get into this tutorial. First I'm gonna start off with color BS. It's kind of like a tannish, orangey color, has little bits of glitter in it. Next I'm gonna move on to TMI. It is a maroon color that I'm gonna stick in the crease. Now I'm gonna move on to fourth right. It's kind of also maroon, but it's a metallic version of TMI that I'm gonna place on top of my lid. Now I'm moving on to Actually. It's a deep brown color that I'm also adding to the crease over that TMI color. Now I'm moving on to Be Blunt. That is a deep, deep, deep maroon metallic color that I'm gonna put over the crease and going up into my brow bone. Now moving on to Truth Hurts, which is a tan color that I'm gonna use to highlight my brow bone underneath my eyebrows. Then I'm gonna finish off with Up Front. It's a frosty, just a frost color <laughs> that I'm gonna place in my tear ducts to bring in the light. And I always like to finish off by blending with a nice fluffy brush. Blend it all together, honey, yes. Now I'm gonna use my favorite Maybelline Eye Studio Gel Eyeliner to eyeline my gorgeous eyes and bring out that color. Next, I'm moving on to foundation. I am mixing Sephora's Deep, that's number 57, with CoverGirl Queen Collection, my fave, Spicy Brown. And I do that because I find that Sephora is a little bit shiny and uh, CoverGirl Queen Collection dries in a powder form. Now I'm moving on to highlight with my favorite LA Girl in color Fawn. And I'm gonna set all that foundation with CoverGirl Queen Collection in medium deep powder. I love it, warm undertone, yes. Rub it in that forehead, girl. Rub it in the forehead. <laughs> now I'm using TMI and Be Blunt eyeshadow for the blush. And I'm gonna finish that off with ColourPop highlighter. I do not know what color this is. It rubbed off, but it's a nice golden bronzy color that just adds that extra pop that you need to finish off your look. Put some on the cheeks, the nose, a little on the forehead. Now I'm gonna use my favorite lippy stick from ColourPop, which is grunge i love this color on my skin tone and there you have it all done so i hope you guys love that tutorial okay it's super easy i've seen a lot of my friends have color pop makeup they make it so easy the colors just really complement one another they have like the best highlighters i love their lipstick there's so many colors that look great on my skin tone affordable and yes if you have any questions feel free to comment in the comments below tell me what your favorite color pop palette is i do want to try a couple more palettes if you have any questions about my hair 
of this wonderful jewelry go ahead and pop your questions below I'll be happy to answer and thank you for watching the Ally show love you guys meow it's Ally cat it's a cat it's a kitty meow yes